All right. Here is the book called Little Bear, and it's by Elsie Homeland Ninark. The pictures are by Marie Sendak. It's an I can read book, and I can read. The first chapter is called Little Bear. What will Little Bear wear? It is cold. See the snow? See the snow come down? Little Bear said, Mother Bear, I am cold. See the snow? I want something to put on. He doesn't have anything on him, but he is a bear. Because he has his fur. So Mother Bear made something for Little Bear. See Little Bear, she says. I have something for my little bear. Here it is. Put it on your head. Oh, said little bear, it is a hat. Hooray, now I will not be cold. Little bear went out to play. How come mom's got a dress and an apron? He just gets a hat. Hmm. Here is little bear. Oh, said mother bear. Do you want something? I am cold, said little bear. I want something to put on. So Mother Bear made something for Little Bear. See, Little Bear, she says, I have something, something for my Little Bear. Put it on. Oh, said Little Bear, it is a coat. Hooray, now I will not be cold. Little Bear went out to play. Here is Little Bear again. Oh, said Mother Bear, do you want something? I am cold, said Little Bear. I want something to put on. So Mother Bear made something again for Little Bear. See, Little Bear, she said, here is something, something for my Little Bear. Now you cannot be cold. Put it on. Oh, said Little Bear, snow pants, hooray! Now I will not be cold. Little Bear went out to play. Here's little bear again. Oh, said mother bear, what can you want now? I am cold, said little bear. I want something to put on. My little bear, said mother bear, you have a hat, you have a coat, you have snow pants. Do you want a fur coat too? He already has one, doesn't he? Hmm. Yes, said little bear, I want a fur coat too. Mother Bear took the hat, the coat, and the snow pants. See, said Mother Bear, there is the fur coat. Hooray, said Little Bear, here is my fur coat. Now I will not be cold. And he was not cold. What do you think of that? Birthday soup. Mother Bear, Mother Bear, where are you, calls Little Bear. Oh dear, Mother Bear is not here, and today is my birthday. I think my friends will come, but I do not see a birthday cake. My goodness, no birthday cake, what can I do? The pot is by the fire, the water in the pot is hot. If I put something in the water, I can make birthday soup. All my friends like soup. Let me see what we have. We have carrots and potatoes, peas and tomatoes. I can make soup with carrots, potatoes, peas and tomatoes. There are all the vegetables there. Looks like they're gonna go into the pot. So Little Bear begins to make soup in the big black pot. First, Hen comes in. Happy birthday, Little Bear, she says. Thank you, Hen, says the Little Bear. Hen says, my, something smells good here. Is it in the big black pot? Yes, says Little Bear. I'm making birthday soup. Will you stay and have some? Oh, yes, thank you, said Hen. And she sat down to wait. She's sitting at the table there. Oh, and she brought him a present. See the present? It's uh, a jar of honey. Next, Duck comes in. Happy birthday, little bear, says Duck. My, something smells good. Is it in the big black pot? Let's see what Duck's brought. 
Oh, it's a beautiful flower and it says happy birthday. Thank you, Duck, said Little Bear. Yes, I am making birthday soup. Will you stay and have some with us? Thank you. Yes, thank you, said Duck, and she sits down to wait. Next, Cat comes in. What's Cat holding? I think it might be an apple. Happy birthday, Little Bear, he says. Thank you, Cat, said Little Bear. I hope you like birthday soup. I am making birthday soup. Cat says, can you really cook? If you can really make it, I will eat it. Good, says Little Bear. The birthday soup is hot, so we must eat it now. We cannot wait for Mother Bear. I do not know where she is. Now, here is some soup for you, Hen, said Little Bear, and here's some soup for you, Duck, and here is some soup for you, Cat, and here is some soup for me. Now we can all have some birthday soup. See, he's walking in the little cups of soup there. He's a very giving bear. Cat sees Mother Bear at the door and says, wait, little bear, do not eat yet. Shut your eyes and say, one, two, three. Little bear shuts his eyes and says, one, two, three. Mother bear comes in with a big cake. Now look, says Cat. Oh, mother bear, says little bear. What a big, beautiful birthday cake. Birthday soup is good to eat but not as good as birthday cake. I am so happy you did not forget. Yes, happy birthday, little bear, said mother bear. This birthday cake is a, a surprise for you. I never did forget your birthday and I never will. <gasps> little bear goes to the moon. Look at mother. Mother bear is sitting there at her sewing machine. It's like an old-fashioned pedal machine there. I have a new space helmet. I am going to the moon, said the little bear to Mother Bear. How, said Mother Bear. I'm going to fly to the moon, said Little Bear. Fly, said Mother Bear. You can't fly. Birds fly, said Little Bear. Oh, yes, said Mother Bear. Birds fly, but they do not fly to the moon and you are not a bird. Maybe some birds fly to the moon. I don't know. And maybe I can fly like a bird, says Little Bear. And maybe, said Mother Bird, Bear, you are a little fat bear cub with no wings and no feathers. Maybe if you jump up, you will come down very fast with a big plop. Maybe, said Little Bear, but I'm going now. Just look for me up in the sky. Be back for lunch, said Mother. Little Bear thought, I will jump from a good high spot far up into the sky and fly up, up, up. I will be going too fast to look at things, so I will shut my eyes. Little Bear climbed to the top of the little hill and climbed to the top of a little tree, a very little tree on a very little hill, and shut his eyes and jumped. Down, down he came with a big plop, and down the hill he tumbled. Then he sat up and looked around. My, my, he said, here I am on the moon. The moon looks just like Earth. Well, well, said Little Bear, the trees here just look like our trees, and the birds look just like our birds. And look at this, he said, here is a house that looks just like my house. I'll go in and see what kind of bears live here. Look at that, said the Little Bear. Something to eat is on the table. It looks like a good lunch for a Little Bear. Mother Bear came in and said, But who is this? Are you a bear from Earth? Oh, yes, I am, said Little Bear. I climbed a little hill and jumped from a little tree and flew here just like the birds. 
Well, said Mother Bear, my little bear did the same thing. He put on his space helmet and flew to Earth. So I guess you can have his lunch. Little Bear put his arms around Mother Bear. He said, Mother Bear, stop fooling. You are my Mother Bear and I am your little bear. And we are on Earth and you know it. Now may I eat my lunch? Yes, said Mother Bear, and then you will have your nap. For you are my little bear and I know it. Little Bear's Wish like he's getting ready for bedtime. Little Bear said Mother Bear. Yes, Mother said Little Bear. You are not asleep, said Mother Bear. No, Mother said Little Bear. I can't sleep. Why not, said Mother Bear. I'm wishing, said Little Bear. What are you wishing for, said Mother Bear. I wish I could sit on a cloud and fly all around, said Little Bear. You can't have that wish, my little bear, said Mother Bear. Then I wish I could find a Viking boat, said Little Bear. And the Vikings would say, come along, come along, here we go, away, away. You can't have that wish, my little bear, said Mother Bear. Then I wish I could find a tunnel said Little Bear, going all the way to China. I would go to China and come back with chopsticks for you. You can't have that wish, my little bear, said Mother Bear. Then I wish I had a big red car, said Little Bear. I would go fast, fast, and I would come to a big castle. A princess would come out and say, have some cake, little bear, and I would have some. You can't have that wish, my little bear, said Mother Bear. Then I wish, said the little bear, a mother bear would come to me and say, would you like to hear a story? Well, said Mother Bear, maybe you can have that wish. That is just a little wish. Thank you, Mother, said Little Bear. That was what I really wanted all the time. What kind of story would you like to hear, said Mother Bear. Tell me about me, said Little Bear. Tell me about things I once did. Well, said Mother Bear, once you played in the snow and you wanted something to put on. Oh yes, that was fun, said Little Bear. Tell me something more about me. Well, said Mother Bear, once you put on your space helmet and played going to the moon. That was fun too, said Little Bear. Tell me more about me, said Mo. Uh, uh, tell me more about me. Well, said Mother Bear, once you thought you had no birthday cake, so you made birthday soup. Oh, that was fun, said Little Bear. And then you came with the cake. You always make me happy. And now, said Mother Bear, you can make me happy too. How, said Little Bear. You can go to sleep, said Mother Bear. Well, then I will, said Little Bear. Good night, Mother Dear. Good night, Little Bear. Sleep well. The end. There's the mother bear and the friend cat and hen and duck and the little bear. And that's the end of the story.